Hell yeah! Nintendo marbles. <laughs> we are on... I'm gonna say our last episode, given that each chapter of the last two chapters fills barely a uh, full screen. Oh, 44 a little bit, but like, that's one scroll. We can do it. We can do it. Okay. 43. Author's note. I think after this I will have about two or three more chapters. Thanks to all my reviewers, not Daft's Flamers. Das Flamers? <laughs> if you flamed Sis Story, then you suck. If you flam, then F you. I walked sexily into the Great Hall. It was empty except for one person. Draco was there. He sat dirt in deadly bloom in his black 666 t-shirt and his black baggy black pants. He had slit his wrists. She spelled wrists right for once in her life. Holy sh- I mean, the last two chapters, you gotta do what you gotta do. <laughs> I felt mad at him for having sex with Snape, but I felt sorry for him. I mean, he did have sex with Snape. Right. <laughs> he looked just like Gerard Way with his red eyes and his pale white face. And that's why you felt sorry for him? <laughs> Draco, are you okay? I asked. I'm not okay. He Oh. I'm not okay! He screamed depressedly. I thought of the MCR song and I got even more depressed because that song always makes me cry. Oh my god. Which one? I'm not okay. Oh. It's literally the title of the song. I am a crap. <laughs> I gave him a pot cigarette. It's me. Remember the time I texted you and asked what a weed cigarette mm-hmm. was called? Yep. It's me. It's actually me. And he Carol? started to... Sm- oh. <laughs> and he started to smoke it. Oh, Draco, why did you do it with that effing bastard Snape? I asked tearily. I, Draco, began to say, but suddenly Lupin and Mr. Norris appurated... Into the room. They didn't see us. I'm so glad we, me, and Snape were freed, said Lupin. Damn, this job would be great if it wasn't for the effing students, Mr. Norris agreed. Oh my god, like every teacher ever does. Like, wait, I get what the Scooby Doo vibes. Yeah! Oh no, why you gotta do Scoob like this? Pop Adelum! I yelled, I yielded angrily, pointing my wand at them. No! Lupin shouted as chains came on him. Mr. Norris ran away. You effing perv, I said, laughing with depths of evil and depressedness in my voice. Now you have to tell us where Voldemort is, or I'm gong to torture you. I don't know where he is, said Lupin. Suddenly, Satan and Vampire ran into the room. Vampire didn't know who Satan was, really. Oh my Satan, we were so worried about you guys, Vampire said. I looked sexily at Draco with his gothic red eyes and with contacts, black t-shirt that said 666 on it and pale skin like Gerard Way. We already got all of this information, I'm so upset. Vampire with his sexy black hair and red eyes just like Frank Iero? Iero? Yeah. Frank? I actually don't know. Just like Frank and Satan who looked just like Brandon Yuri then. Brandon. <laughs> She's the brat! <laughs> Don't hurt Brandon like that. Brandon. My, my Yuri boo thing. Brandon! It's like that one commercial. I don't remember what it's for. But it's like that girl who's waiting on a blind date and she's in her car. and it's, I think it's for deodorant because she's like airing out her pits. Oh she's yeah, like, and Brandon, he it to the Brandon, 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 She's like, <laughs> okay. She's like, shook. <laughs> she's wook. She's wook. <laughs> I am wookus. Oh no. No. Oh, no. no. You made it worse. I did. Okay. Uh, Satan looks just like Brandon Yuri. <laughs> Brandon Yuri, if you want Heard to fight Heard him again. See what I do. Oh God. <laughs> Brandon. Brandon. Brandon, Brandon. I selectively took the caramel from my pocket. When did she get caramel? I want caramel. Me. What's the caramel? Wait, where? I selectively took the caramel from my pocket. Camera. Oh. I know, I was confused. Okay. That took me a hot moment, but. Okay. And then... I began Frenching Draco sexily. Lupin gasped. 
Draco began to take all of his clothes off, and I could see his white sex pack. Then vampire. Oh my god! <laughs> Do you remember wait, that? Wait, yeah. I forgot about that. Yeah, I forgot. It's called a hot sex pack. Okay. <laughs> it's like a pack of sex on your body. <laughs> It's, like, it's relevant. It's just like taped. Yeah, it's just like right, right on your abdomen. It's like this is my sex. Oh my god, we could sell that for like hella oh, dollars. No, this is my. Let's sex exploit pack. the male insecurities. Okay, anyway. Uh, then you. vampire took his own clothes off too. We all began making out together, together sexily. I took off my black leather bra, my black lace thong, and the rest of my clothes. Everyone took their Glocks out except for me. I'm a girl. LOL. Oh my Satan! Draco! I screamed as he put his hardness in my thingy. Then he did the same thing to Harry. I began making out with Satan and he joined in. OMS! cried Vampire. Oh, Vampire! Vampo vampire! I screamed, screamed. Oh, Satan! yelled Harry in Pleasor. Loop. <laughs> Pleasor! Please, sir. <laughs> Lupin watched in shock. We took turns doing torture curses on him because we were all sadists. So you just stopped having sex to torture him. What? Suddenly, dot, 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 a big black car that said 666 on the license plate flew straight through the windows and Snap was in it. Chapter 44. Oh my god. Author's note. Well, I have nothing to say, but if each one stop glamming, okay? I can. I'm too glam. <laughs> too glam for you, Tara. Too glam for fam. If any gothic people are reading this, did you rock? OMG, I still can't wait for it a movie. Tom Fleeton is so hot, lol. I hop Harry will become gothic, because my friend told me he is really emo in this book. OMG, I'm leaving W pretty soon. Can't wait. What is W? Wait. Dubai? She travels a lot. I have a feeling it's, she's like hella rich or something. Probably. Diz will probably be the last chapter until I come back. Little does she know. She never comes back. <laughs> oh no! Did she die? Oh no. <laughs> I got morbid. <laughs> Sorry. That's my car! Shooted Draco angrily. Me. Dance my car! But suddenly it was revealed who was in the car. It was Snape. <laughs> Get out, me car. <laughs> Mom. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> I shall free you, Lupin, but first you must help me kill these idiotic donderheads, he me. said cruelly from the car as it flew circumcising above us. <laughs> That's not a word. <laughs> I can guarantee. She meant circumcising? Which does Irrelevant! Fit. <laughs> Ebony, darkness, dementia, raven, way, must be killed. Then the dork lord shall never die. You effing prep, yelled Draco. Then he looked at me sadly. I forgot to tell you, Ebony. Snape made me do it with him. I didn't really have sex him, but he's a ropeist. A rapist. We all put our clothes on quickly except Satan, who just stood there naked, I guess. With his Glock out. Me. <laughs> we were so scarred. But Satan didn't change. Instead, he changed into a man with gren eyes, no nose, a gray robe, and white skin. He had changed into... Baltimont. I knew who thou were all along, he cackled evilly and sarcastically at me. Now I shall kill thee all. That is incorrect. Thunder came into room. No, please don't kill us, pleaded Vampire. Suddenly, Willow, Bloody Mary, Diabolo, Ginny, Drocula. I forgot about that. Fred and George. Sort of. Hardrid George. and McGonagall. She spelled it right! Dumbledore, oh, there we are. Sirius, <laughs> and Lucian all ran in. What is the meaning of dis? Dumbledore asked all angrily, and Voldemort looked away because Dumbledore is the only wizard he is scared of. Wizard. 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 He did a Wizard. spell, and suddenly his broomstick came to him sexily. Could you imagine the broom moving like. 
Volksmort flex above the roof evilly on his broomstick. Oh, flew. Volksmort flew above the roof evilly on his broomstick. It would have been just as well if he had flexed. Yeah. <laughs> you know, honestly, there's a scene in the fourth movie where he lifts his arms up and he's actually kind of ripped and I always, <laughs> I always notice it. Is yeah, that weird? I know what you're talking about, though. Oh my goth. Slugborn gasped. Get it? Because I'm gothic? One last time, I guess. The Dark Lord... She did it right! The Dark Lord shall kill all of you! Then you must submit to him! Snape ejaculated menacing. Oh my... Almost! Almost! (laughs) You (laughs) effing preppy... Uh, I'm uncomfortable with that word. Sirius shouted angrily. I know a four-letter word for dirt. Cruciatus! (laughs) See, oh my God. Harry. No, you can keep reading. What happened? Okay, you know what that reminds yeah, me of? What? There's this movie from the 80s, and yes. one of the lines, I, uh, what is it? I think it's called Reanimator? No. God, I can't remember what it's called. It's, like, really famous. Anyway, one of the lines is, I came here to kick some ass and chew bubblegum and I'm all out of bubblegum and for some reason that's what it just reminded me of like really stupid like lines before you kill somebody (laughs) I know a four letter word for dirt Cruciatus screamed Harry but the sparks from his wand only hit Draco's car it fell down Snap quickly crawled out of it and picked up the studio camera oh my effing god I cried because the video of me in the bathroom the video of me dong it with Draco and the video of Satan doing it with if you kill me, then these videos will be shown to everyone in the skull. Then you can be just like that gothic girl, Paris Hilton, he laughed meanly. First of all, I'm just going to start at the beginning. If he's dead, can't show the videos to anyone. No. Nope. Second, Paris Hilton? Spelled glad, wrong. Well, I'm glad, gothic. though, that we're making her an icon in this. You know. Because Paris Hilton is everything. She... <laughs> Created wearing track suits, like honestly. Yeah. But if anyone's gonna be a prep, it would be Paris Hilton. But apparently she's gothic. Apparently. No, I screamed. FYI, I have the picture of you doing it with Lupin. What's she talking about? Lupin slurped as he sat in chains. I saw it too. She's gonna show everyone the picture. Harry shouted angrily. Shut up, Lumpkin roared. (laughs) (laughs) It's my favorite. Foolish ignoramuses, yielded Voldemort from his broomstick. Thou shall all die soon. But it's like, dye your hair. Yeah. All right. They'll dye it blonde, maybe. Bleach it. Think again, you effing muggle poser, Harry yelled. And then he and Diablo, finally! (gasps) And Navel. (laughs) (laughs) You get one, not the other. Harry yelled, and then he and and Diablo and (laughs) Navel both took out black guns, but Voldemort took out his own one. You guys are in a Latin standoff, I shouted disparagingly. Was she trying to be, like, like, racially appropriate or something? Like, I... I guess? Because it's usually called a Mexican standoff, but I think she was, like, trying not to be racist or something. That's nice of her. I know. I'm like, I, for, I guess props after all of the problematic things she said throughout this entire yeah, thing. you know. Latin stand of, specifically. Oh. So not only did she do the phrase incorrectly, she right. spelled it wrong. And I, I mean, a, would it be a Latinx stand of? Maybe just like not a term. Is it's it, probably. Wait, is it Latin X? I've heard it pronounced different ways. Okay. Latinx, Latinx. Okay. Echo Neville's wand. That is a spelling of Neville. I'll give her that. Yeah. It's not the right one for no. this situation, but it's a spelling. But we got there. Yeah, yeah. like, it's not Neville. Ironically. <laughs> Neville. <laughs> Ironically, it's the spelling of Neville Papperman from iCarly. <gasps> You're right. Back on the iCarly train. Wow. Full circle. Full circle. Echo Neville's wand, cried Voldemort in suddenly Neville's, another spelling, wind was in his hands. Now I shall kill thee all, and Ebony, you will die. He made lightning come all over the place. 
Save us, Ebony, Dumbledark cried. It's the goth version. Yeah, the goth version. The true goth version. I cried sexily. I just wanted to go to the common room and slit my wrist with my friends while we watched Shark Attack 3 and Saw 2 and do it with Draco. But I knew I had to do something more impotent. (laughs) Something more impotent. Abracadabra! I shooted. That certainly is more impotent. (laughs) (laughs) If I do say so myself. And that is the end of my immortal. Wait, what? That was it? There is um, one chapter technically left, but it's from the person who copied all of this uh, years later. Um, And it doesn't say anything of relevance. But Oh my god, that was it. That was it. We finished it. We did it. This has been a journey. My brain hurts. But that that was it though. Like there was no conclusion. Abracadabra. There was no Yeah. What? It's a type of ending. Not a good one. Not one that I appreciate seeing. Not one that many people appreciate seeing unless there's gonna be like a sequel and you're like, oh cliffhanger. This is not because it was last updated in 2006. So, um... I'm not going to lie to you. I feel incomplete. <laughs> yeah. We'll never know. Mm-mm. We will never know. Mm-mm. Unless, because that one woman came forward and she's writing the memoir that's going to be out, I think, next year. Yeah. Maybe she'll talk about the ending or what it was like. I don't know. But there's that. Um... So we just have to assume yeah, that either she kills Voldemort and everything goes back to normal, them all being gothic and they all get to screw each other, or she gets killed and shit goes back to normal? I mean, that was the hacker's ending. Right. Which is a more complete ending than what we got. Yeah. Um... Uh, um, I don't know. I just don't have enough thoughts right now, to be honest, like, about it. Like, I'm just kind of like, well, that's it. It I think, unfortunately, if she died, everyone would die, because in these situations, in the situations of this alternate universe of Harry Potter, Mm -hmm. she is the hero at all points. So if she dies, no one else can be saved. So if she kills Valksimort, and Snap, and Lupin, and Hargrid probably, I don't know if he was redeemed at the end, maybe a little bit, hmm. um, then maybe they can all continue fornicating wildly. Interesting way to put it. <laughs> Quite a mouthful, but I enjoyed it. <laughs> I mean... That's what she said. Um, sorry, I couldn't not... Please do, it's fine. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> but, um... All 46 chapters? Uh, 44, 44, I believe. Let me... Yeah, 44. We did it. We did it. So, um... We have some ideas for the next season, we'll say, of um, the Cat's Claws podcast. Uh... My mind is just spinning. I know. I'm like, wow. I can't even formulate words. That's how it ended. Wow. Um, yeah, so subscribe if you want to see more seasons. We're going to read some other probably poorly written things. Even though my life will now never be the same after this journey. I know. It's it, Nothing adventure. can be worse than this. That's our only up, up point. Yeah, there, yeah. it's true. Yeah. Um, Feel free to send us your own work. Uh, We can never be as harsh with yours as we have been with this because literally nothing can be this bad. Oh, but I will try to tear your shit apart, so be careful. (laughs) Like, I will try. Uh, Old things probably would be best. Things that you already hate. Yeah. Because, you know... Um, it's just easier that way. So yeah, you know, uh, my information is um, in the little about tab thing on the YouTube channel page. 
Uh, but legendsofmia at gmail.com is where you can contact me for inquiries such as that. Um, follow me on Instagram and Twitter at legendsofmia. Sensing a theme here. Yeah. You're right. Uh, in the comment section, tell us uh, which fandom you want us to go towards next or in the future, because there is um, kind of the opposite... If we're going to consider this satire, and mm-hmm. that's, you know, like the angsty side of Harry Potter, right? there is, I don't know if you heard of it, um, a, a suburban mom, probably. A, 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 an older woman, like middle-aged, I don't know, a mom rewrote Harry Potter in the most Christian way possible. Oh my god. And I kind of want to read it. kind of want to read that, too. Let's do it. That'll, that'll be on the list. Okay. That will go on the list. Yes. Oh, you, you bet. Especially because I don't have, like, a lot of thoughts on Christianity. Like, I'm not, like, about that whole, like, banning certain things because they go against the religion. Like, I don't actually know a lot. Right. So I think it would be interesting for me to, like, witness firsthand and then also for you to critique for me mm-hmm. and get my opinions because then you can kind of translate it for me. Yeah. And, like, I'm a theology minor. Mm-hmm. I consider myself a theologian. And... When I graduate, I want to edit religious fiction or theological nonfiction. So, like, that's an interest for mm-hmm. me. Learning about Satanism was interesting for me yeah. as a theologian and as a person, because that was a wild Yeah, ride. that was interesting, but also scary. Oh. <laughs> um, and then I'm also uh, Catholic. So, like, but I'm also, like, the kind of Catholic who's like, Harry Potter's not going to turn you into a witch. Right. Um, I am, I'm a very casual Catholic. Like... In that sort of sense. Like, right, you're, like, devoted, but, like, in the sense of, like, yeah. you don't think that media can change your... Like, you're gonna be however yeah. you're gonna be, and I feel like, you know, it was the, the more extreme Catholics who were like, if I read Harry Potter, I'm going to be turned to Satan, mm-hmm. but, like, literally, if you have enough willpower to... Avoid Satan's temptations right. and stay in the light of God. You'll be fine. I read Harry Potter as a child. I watched the movies. Same, and I'm I'm fine, I guess. And then I converted to Catholicism. Yeah, right? So what does that tell you? So really. So um, you know, in the comment section, what fandom? If you have a specific suggestion, your own work, and you want to either email me, again, at Legends of Mia, or DM me on either Instagram or Twitter. I think they're both open. Um, uh, or I think there's still a messaging system on YouTube. I don't really know. I think it's through, like, Google, though. Oh, uh, well, then that would be the same email. Mm-hmm. Uh, or just, you know, link me to your work, and I'll read it um, for the podcast. Um... The, wow, what a wild ride. I know. I'm still so upset. So much happened. Ah. Uh, Alright. Abracadabra. <laughs> <laughs>